Diablo 4's most accomplished player, Woody Joe, firmly believes that loot filters are a crucial addition to the game, emphasizing the overwhelming amount of low-quality loot at higher levels. According to him, the satisfaction of finding valuable items should be a more frequent occurrence. While this title is entirely fictional, Woody Joe's exceptional skills and extensive experience in Diablo 3 streaming and Diablo 4 gameplay make him a force to be reckoned with in the Diablo community. Woody Joe has been actively engaged in the Diablo 4 community both before and after its launch. Recently, he took the time to address various questions on the Diablo 4 subreddit providing insightful responses that showcase his analytical approach to the game. While many of us players flounder about aimlessly in Diablo 4, admittedly, myself included, Woody Joe's precision and knowledge of what works and what doesn't make him an unparalleled expert on the subject, it's highly likely that only a select few, if anyone at all outside of Blizzard, possess a deeper understanding of Diablo 4 than Woody Joe. One prevalent player concern revolves around the grind that ensues after reaching level 70, where progress slows down significantly. Woody Joe acknowledges this sentiment, stating that the gameplay can become monotonous once you've acquired legendaries, optimized gear, legendary paragon nodes, and essential glyphs. However, he anticipates that seasonal content will introduce additional elements to alleviate the monotony, potentially offering side quests similar to Helltide. With the game designed to accommodate substantial updates through seasonal content, the upcoming first season reveal will shed light on Blizzard's vision for expanding and enriching the Diablo for experience. Another issue Woody Joe addresses is the overpowering nature of the vulnerability mechanic. He agrees with players who feel that using vulnerability has become almost mandatory for any effective build. According to Woody Joe, every good build in the game requires vulnerability, which creates a sense of limitation and diminishes build diversity. He suggests potential nerfs to the mechanic while ensuring it remains intriguing, proposing that Blizzard can balance these changes by buffing other aspects of gameplay. Despite the current challenges, Woody Joe maintains an optimistic outlook on Diablo 4, considering the potential for post-launch support from Blizzard. As the game continues to evolve, his insights and expertise will undoubtedly contribute to its refinement and future success.